G'day YouTube. I just wanted to do a bit of a video on the differences between Linux Mint 19.2 and Linux Mint 19.3. Uh, both of which are the uh, well with the, the default desktop environment, which is Cinnamon, as we can see here. And we've got uh, the uh, Linux Mint 19.2 on the left, 19.3 on the right. We can also see we've got the desktop environment 4.2.4 here on the left and uh, on the right 4.4.5. And it's really interesting because if you were to have a look at a few of these things here, you can see straight off the bat it's a little bit different. Uh, just the default size ins, the default uh, icons, uh, they're yeah, just a little bit, um, I guess, not the same. And I thought that was pretty interesting. And in fact, um, if uh, we've got all the information here, so I don't have to. I don't think that it's going to tell me any additional information. But now it's just to check for something else. Never mind. So we've got all the uh, the details there. But uh, yeah, I was just curious to have a little bit of a look at this. So it's uh, maybe perhaps they might call it a little bit more uh, more room, a little bit more streamlined, that sort of thing on the right hand side of things. Uh, but if we were to jump across to the window managers as well, the file managers goes by many names then we can have a look and it's going to have some sort of similar variation in terms of the, the cinema version and so the Nemo file manager is fairly much the same. In fact they give it that, that number but it's uh, very similar in, in terms of functionality and even in terms of looks and icon packs, all sorts of things. But uh, yeah, I just did enjoy the, uh, the, the 19.2, the way that it looked here, I guess a little bit bigger, a little bit nicer. The, the menu is for the most part the same, size in, uh, same apps, all those sorts of things. But uh, yeah, just an interesting little look at the difference between 19.2 on the left and 19.3 on the right. The, the visual difference, should I say. So cheers guys, hope you've enjoyed. Please leave a comment, subscribe, and uh, thanks for watching.